بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم سالار خان ہیئر اینڈ کنٹینگ دا ٹاپک آف کلپرس ان دا پریویس ویڈیو وی سا دا سیریز نگیٹو کلپرس اینڈ دین تھری ڈفرنٹ کیسز آف دیٹ ٹوڈے وی سی دا سیریز پازیٹو کلپرس اینڈ دا تھری کیسز آف اٹ سو لیٹ می گیو دی ہیڈنگ دیٹ از دا سیریز پازیٹو کلپر واٹ واٹ دس ڈو The diode would be connected in series with the load. It would clip the positive portion of the waveform. So let's say case number one. Consider a polarity V input. Let me go in a little speed maybe. Because we've already got the main idea. So let's say we have the output taken across this resistor R having a plus minus. We output polarity considering this as an ideal diode. The only polarity across the diode is the input polarity. So what happens depending on the value greater or, ne greater or less than zero this would be forward biased or reverse biased. So first have a look. When this V input is greater than zero this implies what the voltage across the diode is greater than zero. But have a look this is This is what? In the reverse fashion. So this means that this is reverse biased. And reverse biased implies what? That, the, that, the, that there is no current flowing in the circuit. The, the output voltage is zero. Right? Yes. Similarly, now if you have the input voltage to be less than zero. So this would imply the voltage across the diode is less than zero. And this is connected in the opposite manner. This means if the polarity has been reversed, for instance, you suppose that in this manner, negative positive, negative connected to N side, positive connected to P side. You know this. What does this mean? The basics you know. So this means now that the diode is forward biased. And if this is forward biased, so there is a current flowing in the circuit. And this means that the output voltage is directly equal to the input voltage. Considering what? Considering the ideal diodes. considering the ideal diodes let's say let's say we have a, we have a sinusoidal input you can have any sort of an input any sort of an input if this is my v input my v output would be what it is zero for the positive cycle when v input is greater than zero and it's v input for the negative cycle you know this very well the transfer characteristics the transfer characteristics this is vn this is v output transfer characteristics are what the output quantity versus the input quantity graph when v input is less than zero v output is equal to v input v output is equal to e input yes So like this and similarly when we 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 input is greater than zero we output is equal to zero yes it is So these are the transfer characteristics of this so name this circuit please yes you know this is a series positive clipper Uh, we are discussing it under the heading i should have not have given this heading series positive but anyways this is a series positive clipper but an unbiased one so this is an unbiased uh, let me write over here over here this is an unbiased and you know that this is the series positive clipper i've already given the heading yes coming to the next case coming to the next case let's say i have the input voltage considering a polarity v input like this i have an ideal diode load resistor and then a polarity a reference voltage v reference additional dc source whatever you want to name it mostly it's called a v reference represented by a vr or simple v the, our book has named it a simple v anyways whatever is the case the output is taken across this output is taken across this as v output having a polarity let's say plus minus 
okay let us analyze the circuit so have a look this plus is let's say connected to the n side this is making it reverse biased fine this dc source the plus is connected to the p side is making it forward biased let's see we say another method in the previous video we saw the voltage across the diode right so i told you we would be basically considering that one which would be greater so in this case what do we have this would be forward biased if what happens if the reference voltage is greater than the input voltage forward biased if reference voltage is greater than the input voltage so in that case a current would flow and if the current flows so it's only one path that it has to follow and in that case output voltage is equal to the input voltage similarly in the next case in the next case now this is going to be reverse biased when if the reference voltage is less than the input voltage why because the input voltage is making it a reverse bias the p is the, the n is connected to the positive side so this implies what that there would be no current in the circuit and the only output that is that would be equal to the reference voltage and positive value of the reference voltage because it is in phase with the output voltage right if you're not getting this you say there we have a resistor how is this current flowing if this, if this is an open circuit right so how is this equal to this so you could just place a resistor over here for your understanding purpose and now i believe it's clear that v naught is equal to v r let me do what let me draw the the waveforms let me draw the waveforms let's consider a sinusoidal wave again input voltage is a is a sinusoidal wave what do we have for the output v output so 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 have a look uh, vr is greater than v input let's say we have somewhere over here vr so you could also use it like this that v input is less than vr right v input is less than vr So when V input is less than V R, the output is equal to the input. Output is equal to the input. Now, now what happens when uh, V R is V input is greater than V R, so V not is equal to V R. So this would be the case. If this is VR and what about the negative cycle? It's again the, the input voltage is less than the reference voltage. So the output is equal to the input. This is the time period T and it repeats. Okay, the transfer characteristics. Transfer characteristics is what? Output quantity versus input quantity. In our case, we have got the voltages so when the input voltage is less than we are let's say we have a we are over here somewhere let's say we have a we are over here somewhere oh it's a positive we are let's say we have a positive we are here that's not a big deal so when the input voltage is less than we are the output is equal to the input the output is equal to the input right yes so which means uh, just remove this so that we should have a clear graph when v input is less than v r the output is equal to the input like this output is equal to input when input voltage is less than v r and when it's greater than v r so v naught is simply equal to v r so let's say we have a v r over here we have a v r over here yes yes now let us name the circuit so you know very well that this is a series positive clipper but it is this time biased why because we have an external biasing source and the polarity is matching the input and output the reference one so we may we, we call it a positive biased 
सीरीज पॉजिटिव क्लेबर राइट एंड पॉजिटिव ऑल्सो इन अ सेंस दैट दिस वी आर दिस रेफरेंस वोल्टेज इज अ पॉजिटिव वैल्यू हैव अ लुक दिस पॉजिटिव बायसिंग ऑल्सो सजेस्ट दैट वी आर इज इन द पॉजिटिव रीजन राइट लेट अस कंसिडर द लास्ट केस and that would be it for me for today you would see these videos on separate days but i have recorded three now in a row so so this is my last so if this is let's say my plus minus v input this is the ideal diode this is the resistor this is the reference voltage the output is across these terminals v output plus minus when would the diode be forward biased have a look this plus is connected to the n side this minus is connected to the p side both are making it uh reverse biased both are making it reverse biased for the positive cycle i believe so how do i write it i say that if my voltage across the diode is greater than 0 right voltage across the diode is greater than 0 this i would consider when when so this is forward biased going to the previous method so have a look this is a negative connected so you have a negative of vr and this is also connected to the n side so i would consider a negative v input as well so a negative v input should be greater than 0 to make it forward biased which means that my v input should be less than the reference voltage v input should be less than minus of the reference voltage yes or no is it fine minus of v input minus of vr is greater than 0 so which means minus of v input is greater than vr yes it's fine so in this case what would happen this is forward by so current will flow in the circuit and the output voltage would be equal to the input voltage similarly for to make the diode reverse biased the voltage across it should be negative basically we talk about p to n voltage p to n voltage okay p to n voltage so p to n voltage should be negative and when would that be when minus of v r v input minus of v r is greater than 0 is less than 0 right yes when the voltage across the diode is negative which means that uh, this is this would be reverse biased and when is that case when minus of v input minus of v reference is less than 0 or you could say that v input is greater than minus of vr so in that case what would be the case that no current would flow through the circuit and the only thing that we would have in the output would be minus of vr now why minus of vr because we have a look for the output polarities and the reference polarities the current is zero so there is no voltage drop across this resistor so the overall voltage would appear over here or if you don't understand it this way so you could use a load resistor you could say that this is the voltage across the load resistor and that is in parallel with this is vr basically you understand it but anyways anyways so let's say drawing the final graph let's say we draw the final graph so let's say let's say let's say we take a square wave this time input wave form is like this now what do we have the output wave form so have uh, let's say we have a minus of vr is this time our reference so let's say this is some value minus of vr so what happens when the input voltage is less than minus of vr input voltage is less than minus of vr in this case so in that case you would have the output equal to input the output equal to input this is t this is t by 2 and when it is greater than minus of vr input voltage is greater than minus of vr so the output in that case is equal to minus of vr
Isn't it like this? It is. It is. And let's say we draw the final, the final, the transfer characteristics. So I draw it over here. Let's say I draw it over here. This is the input voltage. This is the output voltage. So uh, let's say we have a minus of Vr somewhere. If this is my minus of Vr, similarly if this is my minus of Vr. So when the input voltage is less than minus of Vr, V output is equal to V input. When the input voltage is less than minus of Vr, so V output is equal to V input. Like this. So, so draw this graph for yourself. And then when input voltage is greater than Vr, so V0 is equal to minus of Vr. So this is your final graph. These are number three. Number third graph is what? This is for the transfer characteristics. And let us name the circuit. So of course this is a series clipper. Why? Because the diode is in series with this. So this is a series. And this is a positive clipper because positive portion has been clipped. So this is a positive clipper. And is this biased? Is it unbiased? So it is biased because of the external source. And is it negative biased? Is it positive biased? So this is negative biased. Why? Because have a look for the polarity. Plus minus, this is minus. Plus plus minus, this is minus plus. And VR lies below the axis. I told you that in the in the negative biasing, VR is less than zero. I told you in the introduction video. And in the positive biasing, VR is greater than zero. So that is it about the series clippers. We see this, we saw the series negative clipper in the previous video. Today, we saw the series positive clipper, the three cases, unbiased, positive biased, negative biased. So that is all about the series clippers. See you in the next video with the topic of parallel clippers, shunt clippers. Till then, take care of yourselves and everyone around you. Do remember me in your prayers and do subscribe to the channel. Goodbye.